a very good day to you. My name is Pip and I thank you for watching my new video. Have a good day to you too. I'm gonna put that in the video, you know that. Welcome to skating every day for a week. In this week's video, I am doing a little experiment. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> Marvin. Marvin's providing some sound effects today. <laughs> Enjoy. This week, I'll be skating seven kilometers every single day. Of course, I'm not really doing like a scientific experiment. I'm just having fun. This is just for fun, nothing really scientifically based. I'm going to be measuring my average speed, my average heart rate, as far as my Apple Watch can tell me accurately what my heart rate is. My mental state, so I'm just gonna like see how I feel. And I'm gonna be doing a little singing experiment. I'm gonna be singing around the fifth kilometer of skating on the first day, the fourth day, and the seventh day. Just to see if I improve, if I get better, or if my breath control gets any better. I don't know. So let's see how it went. Why, hello. <laughs> Today is day number one of me skating seven kilometers every single day this week. I've got my skates right here and it's time to put them on. I am wearing very good socks for this. They say naps all day. So what I've decided is that I'm gonna be doing the same round every single day. I'm gonna be doing it on the cycling track because the concrete there is just really good and I want an even playing field for every single day. Bad concrete can heavily slow you down. We're all about getting that good time, you know? I've always just skated for fun. I'm still, it's still fun, but I'm gonna try and do it as fast as I can. I don't know how long I can keep up my fast pace. Definitely not for seven kilometers, but we're gonna see if it improves. I am really excited. I don't know if I'm still gonna be excited if I'm gonna be doing this every single day, but for now, things are looking up. They are on. Let's go. Day three, today we're doing it in the morning, so it's 6.30, let's go. Day four, 6.30, let's go. Today was windy, you guys. It was really hard. <laughs> All right, it's day five and it's the first day that I really don't feel like it. It's so cold outside and it's rained, so it's probably gonna be really slippery, but we're gonna go. <laughs> Let's see how I feel after. Okay, so I just started and I know today is not gonna be a fast one because it's really slippery, so I'm gonna take it slow. I'm really not planning on falling. And also I don't really wear protection because I never did as a kid. I also didn't do it even though my mom told me to. I hated it and I've never fallen but that's because I'm careful. It's gonna bring down my average time, I know it already, but it doesn't matter. A very good day to you. Today it is day six of this experiment and I am so completely done with it. I love skating, but having to do it is not really good for me. It was a Saturday yesterday and today it is Sunday, so I could do it a little bit later, but today that caused me to procrastinate a lot. I did clean the whole house. Marvin and I cleaned our entire apartment, so that feels really good but the rest of the day was kind of just chilling which is good for a Sunday but I had planned to do this early in the morning so that I could have the rest of my day to chill but now I feel bad because I chilled before I did this which I shouldn't feel bad about because I'm gonna do it right now but I don't know I think um, I'm really good at beating myself up about things that I really don't need to beat myself up about so that's maybe a lesson that I can take away from this don't beat yourself up 
I'm just telling myself to do things and if I don't do them, I don't have to beat myself up about it because I'm the only one who promised me I would do this. But I am gonna do it and this is day six. It is really cloudy, really windy and really cold outside just like yesterday, but I feel like the pavement's not gonna be as slippery as it was yesterday. So I think we can make a better time. Yesterday afterwards, I felt really good about myself that I did it. So I think that's gonna happen again today. So let's just do it. Just drove past and I saw it was really busy on the track so I don't think I'm gonna be filming anything and there's people coming by. Today was the best one of all. It was my fastest time and the sun is shining and the weather's just really nice. There's a little bit of wind, but that's okay. All right, so I did it. Seven days, seven kilometers, 49 kilometers in total. I must say I have a bit of a love-hate relationship with skating right now because I don't really like things when I have to do them. So that's not really a good combination when you're trying to do something every single day. I am glad I forced myself though, because I made sure to do it every single day and afterwards I felt so much better. So that's where we get into the mental state part of this all. This really helped me. I feel so much better when I did some sort of workout and well skating this was a workout so I don't think it's actually the skating that made me feel better just being outside and moving made me feel a lot better after I was done but we of course all know that it's been scientifically proven that you feel better because of dopamine I think I don't know don't come for me. As far as speed and heart rate went, I did get a little bit faster. The last day was my fastest day of all, but I do think that that relates to the weather a lot because the days before that, the wind was blowing really hard. It was really gray and really cold outside. And the last day when I had the really fast time, the sun was out, there was almost no wind and I just felt amazing also because of the sun. So I think that gave me a little bit of a boost which made me go faster and not actually because I have had been doing it for six days prior to that. Also, I don't know if there's any way to know if I actually increased in speed because it was such a short period of time and I don't think that you can actually see that, but you know, it's all for fun. In this beautiful little graph, you can see my average heart rate and my average speed. I couldn't really put any seconds in it, so um, I just rounded it up, which is not really accurate because the seconds really do matter when you're measuring time, but you know, <laughs> I couldn't fill them in in the program, so. On one of the slower days, my heart rate was the lowest, which kind of makes sense because I wasn't going as fast. But as far as physical condition goes, I don't really think that these seven days did anything. But I kind of expected that, but I still wanted to take this into account because I think numbers are fun. <laughs> which brings me to some fun facts. I skated for a total of 49 kilometers and those 49 kilometers took me 3 hours, 7 minutes and 36 seconds in total. My worst day was 28 minutes and 14 seconds and my best day was 24 minutes and 39 seconds. My overall average time was 26 seconds and... F oh wait, no. I wish. <laughs> Don't lie to me, one. That's just how I roll! Pun intended. <laughs> My overall average time was 26 minutes and 48 seconds. And now it is time for the most fun part of the video, which is the singing experiment. Let's jump to day one. All right, day one of the experiment. So the first time singing, heart rate is 170 beats per minute right now. <laughs> That's a lot. All right. <laughs> what would you do if I sang out of tune? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Come on, let me your ear And I'll sing you a song And I'll try not to sing out of key I get by with a little help from my friends And I'm gonna try with a little help from my friends And I get high with a little help from my friends Hey! Didn't hit that one. <laughs> Let's see how we do in a few days. Day four, kilometer five. I feel more tired than I did the first time. So we're gonna see how this goes. <laughs> what would you do if I sang out a tune? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Don't wanna lend me your ear and I'll sing you a song. And I'll 
try not to sing out of key. Oh, I get by with a little help from my friends. I get high with a little help from my friends. And I get by with a little help from my friends. Hey. Okay. Day seven. Fifth kilometer. Okay, let's go. What would you do if I sang out a tune? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Come on, lend me your ear and I'll sing you a song. Well, I try not to sing out a key. Oh, I get by with a little help from my friends. And I'm gonna try with a little help from my friends. And I get high with a little help from my friends. Hey, nah. Okay, day seven, still not very good, but hey, and nah. hey, I'm not gonna try it. Okay, let's finish this. She was a skater boy, she said she was a red boy. This is such a missed chance. I should have done that one. I did not do that song. I wish I did. That would have been great. I'm now really sad. I need to redo this experiment. Yes. Well, here you go. Do I think that my singing actually got better? I don't think so. I think I might just need some singing lessons for that. I don't think that my stamina or physical condition is gonna really help. At least not when I'm doing it for seven days. Maybe if it's like a month like the running challenge or if it's for a longer period of time so in conclusion i still really like skating i don't think i will be doing it on the same track like for a few laps every single day anymore because i like also just seeing new things around me and not the same lap over and over again so that's point number one i'm really happy to go back to just skating around the city and seeing new sights every single time i skate but I am really glad I forced myself because I do feel better after skating and speed will probably increase if I am gonna do it more often. But I really like it so I think I will and your singing doesn't really get better in one week when you're trying to do it while skating. Overall, this video was just for good fun. I hope you liked it as well and I thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. If you like this video, Click the thumbs up, let me show you many other videos you probably also like. I